Hey y'all, Bondservant40 here. Wanted to do a face-to-face -face video with you, or screen-to-screen -screen as it may be. <clears throat> I've got a yucky cold and was going to wait till I felt better, but saw a video from a sister along the same lines as God's been uh, showing me, and I thought I need to go ahead and get this video up there. I was reading in 2 Kings uh, chapter 22, and it's about Josiah, who began to reign when he was eight years old, and that he did what was right in the sight of the Lord, and walked in the way of David his father, and turned not aside to the right hand or to the left. Well, he had one of his people go to the house of the Lord to get the silver and the gold out of it, because it had been used for idolatry, to rebuild things the way it was supposed to be. And when he came back out of the house of the Lord, in verse 8, it says, Hilkiah, the high priest, said to Shaphan the scribe, I have found the book of the law in the house of the Lord. And Hilkiah gave the book to Shaphan, and he read it. Then it came to the king, and when the king heard what was written in the book of the Lord, he tore his robe, he rent his clothes. And, uh, you know, he said, woe to us because the Lord's wrath is coming on us because we haven't done what was written. Why hadn't they done what was written? Why hadn't they done what was written in the book? Because the word of the Lord, verse 8, the word of the Lord was lost in the house of the Lord. Brothers and sisters, do we not see that today? How many places that call themselves churches are teaching another gospel and preaching another Jesus. And the word of the Lord is lost in the house of the Lord. Now there's some churches that are faithful, but as a whole we see this. Oh, we see this. And let us be one that brings the word of the Lord back into the house of the Lord. It's a sad day when God's word is lost in God's house. Amen. You guys savor your Savior.